Welcome back to another Pico TV presentation demonstrating the installation of the Pico PL25 electromagnetic uncoupler system. This system is designed specifically for use with Pico quality line ready to run and kit built N-gauge models using the unique Pico LC or sometimes known as ELC couplers which means easy light and close coupling. Now alongside the electromagnetic uncoupler we will be using code 80 N scale track and from the Pico rolling stock accessories the NR103 coupler lift arm packs sold separately. Other items you will need to complete the project are a 4mm drill bit, super glue, a soldering iron, two lengths of wire and a momentary switch or a non-latching push button switch. Not to forget your Pico wagons which the lift arms need to be attached. Inside the pack you'll find a solenoid, a brass mounting bracket, the armature rod and two brass screws plus a pack of lifting arms to get you started. You will find the instructions which are neatly folded up into the rear of the packing and you will want to keep them to one side for reference during your project. We start off by selecting the required position on the layout and drilling a 4mm hole centrally between the two rails and sleepers ensuring the hole is drilled upright and vertically. Then fix the coil into the mounting brackets by inserting the three pegs through the holes in the bracket and twisting the ends. Place the armature rod in the hole through the coil of the solenoid and offer the complete assembly up underneath the baseboard. Important notes, the top of the armature rod should be flush with the top surface of the sleepers. If the armature rod is too long, it can either be cut or alternatively, packing of a suitable thickness can be added between the mounting bracket and the baseboard. Fix the bracket using the screws provided to your baseboard. Now we begin the wiring process. You can solder the two wires onto the two connections either side of your solenoid like this. Then connect via a momentary or non-latching switch to a 16 volt AC power supply. Now we turn our attention to the preparation and fitting of the lift arms. Bend the arm gently until the arm is curved to match this diagram. Push onto the pin on the coupler and glue into place using a tiny blob of super glue, taking care not to allow the glue to go into the coupling mounting. To achieve the optimum, adjust the tail of the arm so that it rests 0.4mm above the rail as shown here in the diagram. With the PL25 installed, now it's time to test it on your layout. Position the vehicle so that the axle adjacent to the coupling is over the armature rod. Activate the uncoupler and when the coupling lifts, move the train away immediately. As soon as the couplings have cleared one another, release the switch without delay. And there we have it, it's as simple as that. We hope you enjoyed this Pico TV presentation and look forward to seeing you again on another one in the future.